I'm Katie Ullman reporting for Katie Chats at the Telefilm Canada Burke's Red Carpet at TIFF 2014. I'm here with Rick Fienstock. How does it feel to be honored here this evening? It feels terrible. It's horrible. <laughs> the worst. It's the worst, really. No, it's fantastic. It's so, like uh, such an amazing group of women. So fun getting all dressed up. It feels very special. And uh, to be honest, at first I thought when I got the call that they were joking and someone was pulling like an April Fool's Day trick on me, but it turns out they weren't. So I'm very, very proud. And you are an award-winning filmmaker, countless nominations, won an Emmy. What advice would you give to an aspiring uh, female filmmaker? It's funny. People ask that all the time. Just stay in the game. Like, I I just think you got to do like you know it's the same thing you'd say anybody who, to anybody who's trying to do something where the odds are stacked against you uh, just keep going it's hard television and film it's harder than it looks and uh, but you just got to keep at it and keep at it and, and trust your gut that really is the most important thing like you listen to your own voice because that's who you are it sounds hokey when I say it it sounds really hokey but it, uh, it's true and you have such a knack for choosing amazing uh, and gritty interesting subjects for your films from the sex trade to the organ trade what how do you make your decisions how do you choose your next project it's not always that deliberate sometimes it's a newspaper article but the last few films it's when I did this film about sex trafficking I met somebody whose wife was trafficked and he I interviewed him and he said I do anything to get her back I even sell my kidney and that kind of planted the seed and then my co-producer had an experience with someone who needed a kidney so that you know the uh, the idea of all so it's always like that but I I, um, I've been doing a lot of investigative stuff in this part of the world where there's so many horrible things happening that you know it, it kind of ma it makes you want to make a film about them and bring those stories home. And where's the best place for us to find out more information on you and your films online? Well, uh, the film, uh, the uh, truth is, I don't have a website yet, but uh, for my current film, Tales from the Organ Trade, there is a website. It's talesfromtheorgantrade.com. And then I guess IMDb. Well, thank you so much and congratulations. Thanks a lot, Katie. It's such a pleasure. Thank you. I know. So nice to meet you.